1105, April 25th, 2013. And then there was one. One day left. Amber and I leave tomorrow. Uh, tomorrow afternoon sometime. Uh, during the afternoon, AJ is taking... Uh, is partaking in a... Uh, graduation ceremony. He finished his corrections officer training. Um, this week was just a, an Aboriginal awareness type course. Uh, so his final result was a 90% average, which is impressive. I am really pleased. You know, I have some smart boys. All three of them are just very smart. And, uh, you know, I'm kind of lucky that way. Anyway, um, you know, I've been trying to record and put videos up, but my SFB has been so bad that it's gibberish. You'd think you were talking to someone that was drunk. I can't keep on topic. So I'm going to try and keep this short and hopefully only have what I wanted to talk about. Uh, we'll see how that goes. Anyway... I wanted to show you something here. This is on the CBC News Manitoba feed that I get on my uh, computer homepage. Where is it here? Winnipeg sees warmest temperature in six months. Let's see if we can hold it steady enough that we can read it. Probably not. Uh, there we go. Well, let me scroll it up first. Oh crap. I bumped the mouse. There, long waited warm is here and finally. Uh, temperature in Winnipeg on Wednesday reached 5.2 Celsius. That's far below the normal daytime high of 14 for this time of year. It's the first time in six months Winnipeg has been that warm. The last time the mercury went above or up to 5 degrees was Halloween Day. And Amber and I are leaving for warmer weather and f on Friday, which is going to be 13. And we'll be in the States on time for the 18 and 16 degree weather that we're getting on the weekend here. So we have been lucky that it's been melting slow and... Uh, I'm going to give you a qu real quick look, and then I'm going to shut this video down before I uh, before I talk too much. So I'm going to show you the backyard first. Uh, the last few days, a lot of snow has gone. That's uh, you know, that's quite obvious by what you can see here. There's just little bits of snow. Uh, the snow was over that chain link fence back by the by the white uh, 240. Um, it's very hard for me to see in the uh, sunlight, but you can see that uh, it's almost all gone. And surprisingly, the backyard isn't a swamp, which normally it is. So it's been a slow melt and it's been allowed to run off or soak in. Look out, Belle. Our miniature Eskimo, American Eskimo lakes laying down right at the front door so she knows if someone's coming or going. Now the front, a little bit different. Uh, it's still about four feet uh, right here. It's still about a four foot drift. Probably down to, uh, I don't know, 18 inches there. Coming along here, it's about maybe 20. And... Uh, well, you can see that that's uh, that's the 510 uh, front fender, so you can see it's maybe 8 inches below that. But uh, a lot of snow has gone in the last few days. There's the van backed in, partially packed. I just have to do a little more packing of my stuff. And uh, Amber and I have a con.
concert to go to for Taylor, or one of our granddaughters. Uh, she phoned and asked Grandma if we would go, and of course we would go. Um, so, this time in 48 hours, we're going to be somewhere between Fargo and Kansas City on the way to, to meet up with Mr. Greg Porter and uh, maybe check out his dad's model railroad, maybe have some, you know, some have a coffee or grab something to eat quick at a restaurant or something and have a quick look at his car. I'm, I'm really looking forward to that uh, the car. Like it looks good. Looks good enough on video, and video never does justice to uh, to the efforts that people put in, the, the attention to detail. So I'm looking forward to meeting him and seeing the car. Uh, so before I babble on even more, there you have it. Winnipeg is seeing its warmest temperatures since Halloween. We're going up to plus 5. And right now, I'll just tell you, it is plus one. So we're not there yet, but we're supposed to be getting there. I'm just going to double check on the other site, just to see if it's the same. Yeah, they're both at one, plus one. So here we go. Since October 31st, we haven't been any higher than plus five. Six months. Anyway, soon to be southbound Iceman, signing off, take it easy, have a good one.